Hey, we're in San Fran. We're about to meet up with Brad. He's one of the co-founders of the Bicycle Coffee Company. They deliver fair trade, organic, locally roasted coffee by bike. Let's go take some hills. There are tons of businesses in San Francisco that rely and love their local community vendors, but there is no way that these businesses could get products from their local vendors. And we fit that need, we filled that responsibility, which is delivering organic, fair trade coffee to offices on bicycle. We are the fresh local alternative for the big guys. Because we have a local roastery and a local operation, we have the upper hand in providing a produce when it's fresh. And that's why we're the fresh local alternative. We'd met with a lot of these really cool coffee farmers in Central America. I'd seen their, uh, basically their operations that had been sustainable over the last 150, 200 years with just with their families. I can say that when we're purchasing a bean from farmers that we'd visited, just personally recalling what that area looked like and how we, we'd had a massive interest in sustaining that for as long as possible. I say that that's one of the connections and programs like Fair Trade will provide them more money for the individual farmers in order to, to pay them a livable wage so that they can make decisions and the decisions that they make are obviously going to include their livelihood. It's part of their life and we're funding and fueling that lifestyle into the future. The way that we started roasting coffee was with a wok and a wooden spoon on the stovetop. Mm -hmm. You know, that's how we started. And then we made a major upgrade and we gone to a popcorn maker, stovetop popcorn maker, Jiffy Pop. It's not only that we're selling a sustainable product and that the beans are coming from a sustainable environment, but that our business itself is mimicking that sustainable concept by not having this massive overhead. Not only are we selling sustainable product, but we are that product. For me, almost no longer me and buy so coffee, it's that I am buy so coffee. It's like I'm riding my bike all day long with these bags in, in my backpack. I'm representing the business. My telephone number is on every bag that we produce. Yeah. And you can get a hold of me at any time of the day. And when you're speaking with somebody from buy so coffee, you're speaking with one of the owners. This is a, the type of business that's recognized as a micro replicable business. By making small, very efficient systems so Bicycle Coffee Company and Mission Workshop, you guys co-inhabit the same space, but not the same company, correct? We're not the same company. They're our brother company. And Mission Workshop produces the highest quality urban apparel, bags, and basically everything else that you can use for somebody in our, in our situation. And I can say that without their bags and without uh, their support here as a hub in the Mission of San Francisco, that we could not be as successful as we are today and oftentimes not physically be able to deliver the quantity of coffee that we need in order to, to make sure that we can be successful as a business. So yeah, beyond just helping, I trust them completely and want to grow together for as long as we can possibly uh, do that. Okay, so huge fan of these shoes, but they're not only awesome shoes as far as design, comfort, etc. Reverse the side, they're also bike leads. So, Perfect for the urban creator. And that's that's what I want to do with this. I don't want to be physically building every single part of bicycle coffee in every new city. What I'd like to do is build it once really well and then replicate that business in each new place where we exist. The environment that I'm involved in is more important than the money that I have to spend in that environment. Being able to do what I want when I want, go where I want, and, and be the person that I want are more important to me as a currency and as a model than having whatever amount of money you can consider. My name is Brad Butler. I'm one of the family owners of Bicycle Coffee and I'm 29 years old.